There. That will cover the human ears if those rings disable the glamour. No lying, huh? Still want to go through with it? I... I can't be with that family forever. And Fiery's the inspiration I need to get the fashion scholarship. I will try to get in touch, but... <gasps> I am your best friend. You said so. <laughs> I knew I'd win you over, Ella. She is. As radiant as an early morning. Uh, please, I already agreed to help. You don't have to keep laying on the charm. Oh. <laughs> there is no poetry in your souls. <sighs> Just a moment, milady. My lord? <sighs> hmm. So... Why are you willing to help Prince Tiernan boy pretending to be his fiance? Hmm. I... I've never been to the Sealy Court. I'm curious about what it's like. And your guardians. Will they not miss you? I live with my stepmother and her two daughters. They will only miss having me there to take care of the house. Plus, do all the repairs and whatever else they enjoy forcing me to do for them. Huh? Wait, 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 wait. Uh, Jadrija's a servant? Um... You can see why it might be nice for me to get away for a while. Wow. Are you a spy? Did you swear allegiance to the Seely King? No, and... No! Seriously, I mean no harm. All in time for your cause. Hmm. Any more questions? If I find out you have somehow been untrue, you'll be back home with your wicked stepmother before you can blink. And that is if I let you live. Understood. Before we go forward with this, you must promise me something. You can't fall in love with me, okay? What? This is a business arrangement. No love. It is just temporary. I am aware. I'm here for some pretty dresses and an invitation to the ball. Oh, and a couple of months without having to scrub anybody's dishes. Hm. Well, maybe you should be careful not falling in love with me. Oh, that'll never happen. What? What's wrong with me? Not your type of princess? No, no, you're you're fine. Huh? <laughs> hmm. Gee, thanks. <laughs> it's only uh, girls say they're not going to fall in love, and then, well, <sighs> just be on your guard, okay? <sighs> well, fine. Rule number one: no falling in love. Rule number two: I don't think we need rules exactly. Obviously, we do. Rule number two, no bedroom business. Bedroom business? I don't know why you think I'm just going to tumble any vaguely pretty maid on my path. I will have you know I am faithful to my future queen. 
Oh, who does this woman think she is? I'm in bedroom business. Declan? As far as Zoe know, he just kisses them at parties. <laughs> Many parties. <laughs> hey! <laughs> uh, I really chose not to ask about that sort of thing. So, what is your third rule? <clears throat> My rule number three, no betraying the Crown Prince Tiernan. <sighs> Agreed. Doesn't hurt to be safe, brother. So, are you two supposed to kiss now? It's not actually hand-fasting. <sighs> but they need to play pretend from now on. In public. So, ready to meet my tyrant of a father and his court of vipers? Of course, sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. It'll be fun, I promise. <laughs> <laughs>